Hello and welcome back to the gun school. James F. Grimes. So we're here shooting another video and today I've been working around the house primarily and got into looking at weapon systems and uh, so I got out the uh, I got out the uh, the M the M15 and we we cleaned this thing up and I grabbed the bag the uh, the gear bag for this uh, weapon and and that's pretty much what I want to talk about today is uh, we kind of upgraded this thing uh, originally this is a Camelback carrier but I've taken out the bladder and uh, I'm not going to be using that but. Uh, this does have really cool attachment points, so I guess I'll start off by stating that we've uh, attached on a uh, compass, engineer's compass here on the front strap. Uh, normally I'll put on a really big knife on the uh, secondary strap here. Um, here on the back side, um, I've got a tool kit slash cleaning kit uh, along with a boar snake. Um, also on this one here is a military issued. Uh, M16 cleaning kit along with all the brushes uh, and then also here we've got the Gerber uh, Gerber tool exclusively designed to be uh, helpful with the uh, uh, AR-15 um, inside we've got some mags I've got uh, double 20 rounders they're attached these uh, these are pretty cool to have um, on the bottom pockets, we're looking at additional, oh gosh, four 30 round mags. Um, these are, oh, <laughs> they're good to have. They got rubber bumpers on the bottoms of them. So these these have been shot with OD green and, uh, and they got rubber bumpers on the bottoms. Um, when you just push the button, they fall out. Uh, those are always unique. And then cool. Um, also in here, yeah, we have got the Vietnam Vintage uh, bipod. Uh, this is the design that they use actually in Vietnam. This is a reproduction. It's not an original one. Um, and also, we've got scope telescope sight along with the uh, emergency pop-ups. Uh, in case something goes wrong with the scope, we actually can go back to iron sights instantly. Um, and if you noticed on the weapon itself, we had a, a small red dot for stuff out to 25 yards. And then after that, you would graduate up the telescope sight. So anyway, the, the bag itself really isn't that heavy. Uh, it's not a very large bag. It's easy to transport around and it's got all the gear all the essential gears gear that you would possibly need uh, for a, a day mission or um, a hike or or just for training um, it's it's good it's good to have um, I'm, I'll probably need to go out and teach some more classes uh, utilizing AR-15 rifles I really haven't had a chance to do that this year uh, because the circumstances beyond my control and uh, I'm sure we all understand what those are but uh, but anyway um, there are classes coming uh, this fall uh, the next big one is going to be shooting in public and that is a pistol only course and that's that's coming up real soon you have my information you guys know how to get a hold of me if you want to get involved in this class um, it's cheap. It's like $50 a person. It is an all day class runs about six hours. So anyway, um, wish you were here. Remember, let safety be your main target. Thanks.